Hello nerds, welcome to Ahmed Coaching and I'm your teacher Dr. Anam. Today we are going to study about cellulose and glycogen. The cellulose is made up of beta glucose. It means that beta glucose molecules they are going to combine together to form cellulose molecule. While on the other hand glycogen molecules are formed when alpha glucose they are going to combine together. I have already told you so many times what's the difference between the alpha and beta glucose. But again um, just to remind you I will explain it that in alpha glucose the OH group is present below the plane. While in case of beta glucose the OH group is present above the plane of carbon 1 so this is the difference between beta and alpha glucose the cellulose it can be obtained from the plant while glycogen is obtained from the animals the linkage which is present in the cellulose is beta 1 for linkage beta is because there are beta glucose present and 1 for linkage is that the carbon 1 and carbon 4 they are going to make the bond between them the carbon one of one glucose and carbon four of another glucose so this is the linkage which is present in the cellulose while in case of glycogen we have alpha one four alpha one six linkage means two types of linkages are present in the glycogen the alpha means that alpha glucose is present one for mean the same that uh, the linkage is formed between carbon one of one glucose and carbon four of another glucose while one six linkage is formed between the carbon 1 of one glucose and carbon 6 of another glucose. The purpose of cellulose is to provide support and protection. We know that cell wall which is present in the plant cell is going to protect the cell as well as the organelles. So it is providing the support as well as the protection. While in case of glycogen it is going to store the excessive glucose in the liver or in the muscles. The cellulose it will not be dissolved in the water while the glycogen it is poorly dissolved in water. There are no branches in case of cellulose you can see here it is a straight structure and why there are no branches because there is no one six linkage present while in case of glycogen branch structure is present and these branches are formed because of this one six linkage. The cellulose is difficult to break while the glycogen is easier to break. Why it is easier to break? Because you can break it here where the 1,6 linkage is formed. To digest the cellulose you need cellulase enzyme. While to break down the glucose you need two types of enzyme glycogen phosphorylase and glycogen debranching enzymes. With iodine the cellulose is going to give no color it means that the original color of iodine it will retain while the iodine is going to be converted into red color when it is going to react with the glycogen so this is all about cellulose and glycogen i will see you in the next video